all vulnerable to the mental health impacts of the pandemic, and our teachers are among those experiencing some of the most significant changes to their daily lives. Well, now the Aurora Public Schools stepping up to help them manage the stress. CBS 4's Karen Morfitt talked to the district about a new virtual mental health program being offered. Karen, this was something they've been talking about for a while. Jim, even before COVID, they were trying to get more mental health tools to their teachers and their staff. When this happened, it became even more important to make this happen. And when schools closed, it became a priority. For two months, teachers have been transitioning their lesson plans from the classroom online. The challenges of teaching virtually got to be extremely stressful. Megan Lonergan, director of employee relations at Aurora Public Schools, says with those challenges in mind, they fast-tracked a partnership with Maru Health to offer more accessible mental health support. When you're having a bad day, you don't have to wait a week to speak to your therapist. It's a type of digital care that Brett Shrewsbury with Maru Health says is needed now more than ever when not every office is open or not everyone feels safe venturing out. They get on the Maru Health app and a clinical therapist actually guides them through a 12-week program to really, you know, activate behavioral change. Shrewsbury and some will be looking for that person-to-person -person interaction as accessibility helps build a similar relationship. The connection our therapist is making with the patient is actually very, very strong because we're interacting. By daily. For teachers and staff at Aurora Public Schools, it's an added resource to help navigate what will be an uncertain path forward. It's really changing habits and practices rather than just intervening at the moment of crisis. Now, in addition to the smartphone app, that program also uses a wearable biofeedback device as well. Now, this is also free to anyone in the district. In, in live tonight, Karen Morford covering Colorado First. Thanks, Karen.